Hello, hope you are doing good. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to make QR code for Amazon registry. The first thing you want to do, once on your Amazon app, you are going to tap on the three dashes in the bottom right hand corner. Once you have tapped on the three dashes, you will see the option list. You could tap on that. Or if you don't see the th if you don't see this when you go there, you could tap on your profile icon right at the bottom of the page. After you have tapped on your profile icon, you will see the option list and registry and you could select the registry from there. For example, let's say I would like to share the wedding registry right here. And by the way, if you don't know how to create a registry, all you'll need to do is tap on create a list in the top right hand corner. And from there, you'll be able to add your registry name, then tap on create list. So we're going to tap on wedding registry. Then to share it, all you'll need to do is tap on menu in the top right hand corner. Then you are going to tap on share. After you have tapped on share, from here you are going to tap on share my registry. Then I want you to tap on copy. Once you have copied it, the next thing you're going to do is close out of the Amazon app and you're going to go into your browser and I want you to go onto bit.ly.com. Bit.ly is known for being a link shortener, but they also make QR codes. So all you'll need to do is go onto bit.ly.com and you can create an account for completely free. Then from there, you're going to tap on go to QR code. Then you're going to tap on create a QR code. After you have done that, you are going to paste the link that you had copied. Once you have pasted the link, from there you can add in a title. So let me clear this first section right here. So all you want to leave is the URL. So you are going to clear the text. Then from there, I'll simply type in test. Then done. Then from there, you can see the domain. And if you would like to add any custom back half optional, you could do that. Then after you're finished, all you'll need to do now, you're going to tap on enter. So all you'll need to do is tap on enter. Let me do that real quick. And then you can see the QR code right here. So you can choose whether you'd like to download the, P the QR code or if you'd like to copy the code. So if you'd like to download it, all you'll need to do is tap on download PNG and that's it. Hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe.